Okay, so before you start your HNT mining, before you go for your device, it is important for you to do a little survey about your area to know if it will be profitable for you or not. To do that, just go to explorer.helium.com and uh, when you are here, you will find this map. So let me first of all take you to Nigeria, Lagos, Nigeria, where we have some hotspots present at the moment. Then use the minus button to make it smaller so that you can you can move faster. This map is similar to Google Map. If you know how to use Google Map, it's the same thing. Okay, so when you see these green dots around, then you know that is your hotspot. So you can zoom towards them and figure out what is going on with these hotspots. All right. Okay, when I move towards one, I can see the hand point changes, so I can click on one and see how it looks like. Let me click on this one and let's check the statistics and see what is going on with this particular hotspot. This hotspot is in Lagos, early Nigeria. Uh, it's rural ultraviolet dinosaur. That's the name of this particular statistics we have some seven months ago record here so let's click on it wow so it synced at the moment one day ago in the last 24 hours it has not made any increments or changes is zero UTC and we have 0, 0.00 US dollars. But let's check the last 30 days. For the last 30 days, we have um, 0 0.115 UTC, which is equivalent to 2.74. US dollars last 30 days and uh, he is making about 30 negative 34.894 percent of earnings and that is not looking very good for him let's look for another one let's click this one this hotspot is two months set up and you can see already it's 3.51 HNT in 30 days. Let's go deep. So you have 24 hours ago. This has been 0 0.198 UTC, which is equivalent to 4.71 US dollars. It has made a significant increase in earning as a 25.02%. And when you check the last 30 days, the last 30 days has been making some significant amount of earnings. We have 3.509 UTC, which is equivalent to 83.61 US dollars. And uh, that is still negative 11.204%. Uh, if it continues, definitely you will break even very very easily let's check another one custom marigosh tiger 2.18 hnt within 30 days four weeks ago let's see what has been going on in details
on this video we just want to focus on the earnings how the various hotspots are doing so we have here 0 0.125 and uh, 0 0.125 equivalent to 2.99 uh, 5 point, negative 5.526 percent uh, when we check the last this for 24 hours when we check the last 30 days let's wait and see the last 30 days last 30 days earnings are 2.176 and uh, he's been making some good profits of 52.05 US dollars then he has broken even and he's still making some good profits if he continues, he will keep making good profit. Let's check this one out here. Okay, so let's check. Um, press host tree, but also ever it is olive, also ever. Let's see what is going on. When you click on a point, uh, you can see where uh, the, the, the hotspot that it is trying to communicate with. You can see from this point to this point, it's communicating from here to here. And um, the last 24 hours is be able to make zero, uh, negative 100 percent. If you go to the last 30 days, this is it. Uh, in the last 30 days, be able to make 0 0.078, and uh, that 1.87 US dollars is making some increment. Uh, 0.024 percent. Um, he's having um, 4 DBI analysis. He's using a bobcat. You can see he's using a bobcat miner, and uh, it's for it's having a that bobcat is having a 4 uh, 4 DBI. That is the, the signal strength. That's the number at which it can travel. Uh, it's mounted on about 50 meters tall pole. Wow. It could be mounted on a mountain or somewhere in addition to some top pool. That is the height, 50 meters tall. Wow, and this is the profit. You see, when you have your hotspot mounted, the hotspot, the hotspot have um, to be mounted in an area where there are no interferences. Sometimes when you have so much mountains, buildings, around and you should be able to also point to the direction where you can have access to other hotspots around so that you can uh, get your mining synced easily so if your area is not very conducive you can go from the map next video we will do we will show you how you can check from the map how whether as a whether your location you can actually use others who judge from others who are already here to know whether you're able to make profits. But then you can also do that check by knowing the area in which you are, how it looks like, whether you are mounting the valleys, how tall should be your pool, if you are going to mount your antenna on the pool, how tall should be your pool, and um, what kind of cables you are going to use. If cables, cable qualities are bad from your antenna to your device, you may not. All these informations you may get when you subscribe to our channel, we are going to give you more information. But for now, before you start, these are the things you can do to actually have an overview of what may transpire when you start your HMT mining or helium mining. I'm going to Ghana to find out what is going on in Ghana. I've seen a few people doing the mining in Ghana. Um, around Tema and the northern region of Ghana. Just some few of them. My in Ghana. Okay, so this is Tema. You can see Kumasi has some 
the Tema also uh, Tema has there's a dot there. So let's go to Tema here. That's Tema B at the top. Tema B has a dot there. Let's go to Tema below uh, and see what is going on in Tema. I'll just pick one of this and uh, we'll see. Let me zoom it a little bit bigger. Okay. Very good. Um, let's wait for a while. Okay, so energetic header, ferrets. It's making a 0 0.09 HNT in 30 days. Less is done six months ago. <laughs> okay, so we have here zero, and uh, that's for the last 24 hours. Let's go to 30 days. Within 30 days, uh, it's been able to make 0 0.094 uh, UTC, and uh, that is 2. Point uh, two five US dollars positive nineteen point four five. It's very very important to know these figures. This pool is about seven meters up. Uh, that's the antenna is about seven meters up. It's having four dBi of cuts, and that is good. Uh, somehow looking okay. Maybe in the future, may be able to get something. But uh, these are the things you have to know first of all. What is your investment? How much do you invest into your devices? If you are doing HNT mining, you are buying your HNT miner, you are buying um, the routers for your internet, you are going to be paying for internet, you have to factor in how much your antenna costs you, uh, the cables and accessories, the pools you are using, everything that you are using to do your mining, you have to know how much the cost is. Let's assume your cost is a total of 1000 US dollars and you are making um, in 30 days 2.25 uh, US dollars, you can imagine uh, how many days or months or years it's going to take you to start making even uh, with your investment. You can do it for passion, uh, yes, or, or for uh, for funds, or for anything, and later on start realizing some good profits in the future. Or you can actually say that is the business, you want to do a business in that, you want to really invest. So you have to do a lot of market research analysis uh, or statistics based to know what exactly uh, is going on in the market before you uh, and around your environment even if not in the entire market what is going on in your environment where you actually want to mount your your hotspot what is actually going on there how much are those who are already there making if there's nobody there then you have to take a risk and try and see um, when you do your settings you have to be changing your settings to uh, maybe you start making some increments. You can do more access points, or uh, I mean, more hotspots. You can do more hotspots and get more antennas around in different different locations to see if you can start making some good profit. Well, this is what all we have for you right now. We will still be checking in these areas, especially in Africa, to see how the uh, human mining is doing, whether it's becoming more profitable for. For you to, to join. If you subscribe to our channel for our future videos, we will actually tell you what is going on with, let's, let's take for example, energetic heater forest, how it's doing so far after one year or two, what has transpired. So we encourage you to subscribe to our channel for more uh, information about these people and about this area, this environment, uh, Ghana. Nigeria, um, Togo, and Africa, South Africa will be doing a lot of uh, search on them to actually find out whether the helium mining is doing very well for you to do your investment. Thank you very much. If you subscribe to our channel, you'll get more information. Thank you.